talking about, obviously, uh, you've been over here a couple months. Uh, mm -hmm. Suffering any culture shock from, from being uh, part of Yeah, kind of. Like, some people don't understand my accent and little things like that. Um, but, yeah, everything's going fine. The people are really nice over here. Um, you know, the transition was a big shock. Like, coming overseas, it's like seven hours by plane. So, first couple of days, I was a bit jet-lagged and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm enjoying it. Everything's going great so far. You were on England's uh, the national teams mm -hmm. in your experience. Talk about how much that has helped you as a basketball player. And, and um, yeah, from an early age, like 13, I was selected for the national team. Um, it was a big honor. Um, you know, going to games where there might be like 5,000 people at a young age. So that was a good experience for me as a young kid growing up. Some of our fans might not know much about uh, Canarias Basketball Academy. Mm -hmm. Talk about what that did for you and exactly what it was. Yeah, um, when I was turned 14, I started playing for Canarias Basketball Academy. It's like a, a big academy that recruits players from all around Europe, some players from um, the Americas, and it helps to get players better, to play, prepare for Division One basketball. Um, so growing up, I was part of that for five years. So I saw a lot of players come and go. Um, it's recruited 42 Division One players over the past five years. So in Europe, it's a big, it's pretty renowned place. So in Europe, it's pretty well known. What would you say is your biggest strength as a basketball player? And what's the area you need to improve on? Um, for me, my jump shooting has pretty, been pretty good for me my whole life, you know, um, I've always been able to make shots and stuff like that, but coming to Division 1 basketball, I think I need to gain a lot of weight if I'm going to be playing the post and little things like that, so I'm working hard to put on weight and um, just do that over the summer, really.